sincerity. Get ready for your biggest loser workout. Turn to the side for this exercise. Let's do a jab and cross. Stand in guard position with your left foot forward. Throw two punches straight out in front. Keep it controlled. Pop. Keep your elbows and knees soft. Locking out or throwing wild punches could stress your joints. Try to punch out further so you get a nice twist in your upper body. Great job. You better be working. Excellent. Turn to the side for this exercise. Now for a jab and cross on the other side. Right foot forward this time, throwing two punches right out in front. You're gonna do the best that you can. As long as you're breathing, you're gonna be absolutely perfect. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. You're a total machine. Way to go. Excellent, looking solid. Okay, cool. Now let's bring it back to the front so that you're facing me. Jump rope with high knees. Keep those knees up high, but make sure you keep your balance. Try to land as softly as you can on the balls of your feet. Really nice. Perfect form. and just march on the spot. Arms and legs move alternately. This is a nice and easy way to warm up your entire body. Stay with it. Try to land your feet softly. Don't stand. Very well done. Move your legs a little more if you can. Perfect, just like that. Really nice. Really good. It looks like you're not really moving your legs. Try to keep those knees up. We're gonna go into some trunk rotations. Bring your knee up to maximize the abs workout. Keep your balance and make it a nice fluid movement. Up and twist, then back down. Only twist as far as is comfortable. Try to get a better twist by moving your shoulders more. Don't forget that going too fast will count against you. Nice job. Great job. Try to get a better twist by moving your shoulders more. Try to get a better twist by moving your shoulders more. If you're going a little slow, just keep going, and when you feel ready, you can try to pick it up a bit and get closer to the trainer's speed. I'm warmed up, you guys. Excellent work. Keep it up. Take your arms out to the side. Now, reach for your toes as you kick out in front with the opposite foot. Feel a good twist across your trunk as you reach over. If you can't reach your toes, don't worry about it. Go to the knee. Kick it out. How's this one working your upper body muscles? You're getting your kicks nice and high there. That's what I like to see. 
You're cruising now, but let's see you hold on till the end. I want the best from you all the way. Good. Keep those kicks high and stay balanced, just like that. Breath, I want to hear you breathing. Good. Keep those kicks high and stay balanced, just like that. Let's move on to some side steps. Make sure you don't make your steps too wide. Great job. Really good. How about that? Perfect form. Perfect, just like that. Nice shallow jumping. Your body's straight, abs in tight. Make sure your hands are moving in small circles at your sides. Shoulders are relaxed. Bend your knees slightly when you touch the ground. Try to land as softly as you can on the balls of your feet. How's it going? We can break for water if you want to take a moment to recharge. I'm okay, keep going. Okay, remember to keep hydrated. Exercise makes you sweat, and you need to replace that water. Beautifully done. Excellent, looking solid. How about that? Perfect. Wood chops. With this one, I want you to swing your arms down and to the left as if you're chopping down a tree. Execute a nice controlled motion. Don't throw your arms down. Also, be sure to bend your right knee and twist your core as you chop. Keep your knees soft and breathe out as you chop downwards. Twist at the waist and don't bend too much. Really good. Belly button into your spine. So impressed. Beautiful. Now, let's swing those wood chops over to the right. I want to keep your heart rate where it is. Perfect. Doing all right so far? I'm feeling good. You're a total machine. Way to go. They make it easy. You've got a great score on those full body exercises. Well done. Now drop your plane down a little bit lower. Try to keep your weight back on your heels. Good job. Keep it rolling, stay on it. Good rhythm. Solid, you guys. Make me proud. Peace. 
Ready for some skating? Let's go. Side to side steps with a little hop. Keep your arms swinging to stay in rhythm and work your upper body too. Only hop out as far as feels safe for you. We don't want you slipping with this one. Nice job. Perfect, just like that. Great job. Excellent. Very nice. I'm so impressed. Beautifully done. Very well done. Very nice. And into slip uppercuts. Duck and weave from side to side and throw a clean uppercut at either side. Don't throw your punch too hard. You just want a nice swinging movement for this one. Don't bend your knees too much as you might put stress on the joint. Those arms ready to drop off yet? This is all you got. You're cruising now, but let's see you hold on till the end. I want the best from you all the way. Turn to the side for this exercise. Butt kicks. Bouncing from foot to foot, kicking your feet back towards your butt, make sure you land safely. Don't go too overboard with this. Make sure you can land gently and safely on each foot. Inhale, exhale. I want you to keep those arms in tight. Follow your trainer's movements exactly in order to do well. I can see you're working hard towards your weight loss goals. Trust me, it'll be worth it. Okay, cool. Now let's bring it back to the front so that you're facing me. Okay, now on to standing mountain climbers. Here you want to punch one arm to the sky while raising the opposite knee nice and high. Try to nail that rhythm. Try to land softly on the balls of your feet to avoid stress on your joints. Keep it rolling just like that. Beautiful. Beautifully done. Fast skaters. Move side to side with a small hop, as if you were ice skating. Move those arms in time. We're doing this faster than normal skaters for an extra calorie burn. This is quite an intense exercise, so push yourself, but don't overdo it. How's it going? We can break for water if you want to take a moment to recharge. You cool? All right, let's keep it rolling, but remember to try to keep hydrated during your workout. Let's go into some lunges. Keeping your left leg forward, take your right leg back. Bend your left knee, but make sure your knee stays over your heel or you'll put stress on it, and we don't want that. Front knee right below the heel.
Get down a little lower for me if you can, but make sure your knee stays behind your toes. Rolling just like that. Great job. Excellent. Going into a jog now, moving your arms in time with your jogging. Keep the pace steady. We're staying at a low intensity with this exercise. Try not to move from side to side as much. How are you doing? Perfect form. I'm feeling good. Perfect. I'm feeling good. Keep it rolling just like that. I'm feeling okay. good. Well, just stay with it and try to take it at your own pace. If you really need a break, then take one. Knees are up. Perfect. Fantastic results on that one. Keep working as hard as you are and you're sure to succeed. Jumping jacks. Swing those arms up high, but try to keep the movement rhythmic and fluid. Nice rhythmic jumping will make this a whole lot easier. Keep it moving. Make sure you land on the balls of your feet and keep your knees soft. Very well done. Very nice. Explosive movement, beginner, just a toe tap, okay? Good, okay. Perfect form. Great job. Standing jacks. Swing those arms overhead all the way up. Keep your abs tight. Don't put too much pressure on your knees. Nice and easy. Just keep the rhythm. Keep moving. Keep your feet hip width apart and your weight into your heels. A little quicker. Slowly get down on all fours, then into plank position. Let's turn 90 degrees to the side for this one. Let's do some hip extensions. Stretch your left arm out in front of you, and at the same time, extend your right leg out behind you. Now pull your arm and leg back in together, keeping your hips level. Now stretch it back out again. Don't overextend your back. Nice controlled lifts. A little quicker. Excellent, looking solid. You look excellent. We 
just want to move through a full range of motion really smoothly, okay? We're going to do the exact same thing on the other side. And now let's go side on. Now extend your right arm forward and your left leg behind to do hip extensions on the other side. A little quicker. Up. Down. Up. Down. Breathe. Focus on the breath. Stay with me here. We're going to try a new exercise in just a second. Now carefully come back up to a standing position. Let's turn 90 degrees to the side for this one. Tap punches. Step forward with your left foot while you left hand punch. Then bring the right foot forward with the right punch. And then step back again to keep a steady foot tapping motion going. Really think about your coordination here. Try to achieve perfect form. Keep those punches nice and controlled. Try to reach the same speed as the trainer to perfect the exercise, burn major calories, and earn maximum points. If you're going a little slow, just keep going, and when you feel ready, you can try to pick it up a bit and get closer to the trainer's speed. Let's turn 90 degrees to the side for this one. Stepping forward with your right foot first for some more tap punches. You're gonna do the best that you can. As long as you're breathing, you're gonna be absolutely perfect. Don't quit on me. You know why? Because quitting on me is quitting on yourself. And that's not what The Biggest Loser is all about. Try to reach the same speed as the trainer to perfect the exercise, burn major calories, and earn maximum points. A little quicker. You've got a great score on those full body exercises. Well done. Okay, back to the front, you guys, facing me. Now for some tire drills. Get those knees up high and keep those feet wide apart. Knees are up as high as you can. Very well done. How's this one working your upper body muscles? I don't think you're lifting your knees high enough. Pick them up a bit roundhouse series. Here you want to step out to your left, then back in and raise your right leg up and down. So it's out, in, lift, and lower. Nice controlled movements. Don't step out too wide. You better be working. Sink it down, poodle. Pick it up. Sink it down, poodle. On the step out, try to take a nice wide step and dip down low to work your thighs. Gut it out and give me everything you have. Roundhouse series. Step out to your left, then back in and raise your right leg up, then down. Okay, now let's ease up a little. This is called an active rest. We're not stopping, we're just conserving a little energy. Remember, it's important to stay hydrated. Do you need to stop to get water before the next exercise? On the step out, try to take a nice wide step and dip down low to work your thighs. 
All right, we'll carry on for now, but remember to drink plenty of fluids. Try stepping out a little further if you can, and try to get down low so it's more of a side lunge than a step. Slowly get down on all fours, then into plank position. Turn to the side for this exercise. Fire hydrants. Getting on all fours, making sure your back is flat. Lift your left leg out to the side with your knee bent. If you can, take your leg all the way up until it's parallel to the floor. Don't arch your back, keep it as flat as you can. Inhale, exhale. Up, down. If you're going a little slow, just keep going and when you feel ready, you can try to pick it up a bit and get closer to the trainer's speed. Let's go to the exact same thing, other side. Turn to the side for this exercise. Fire hydrants. On all fours, raise your leg out to the side with your knee bent. <laughs> Great job. Just like that. Great job. Excellent. Up, down. All right, let's get ready for something new. Now carefully come back up to a standing position. Okay, back to the front, you guys, facing me. Arms up in boxer position and sway from side to side as if you're ducking and dodging punches. Dip down as you sway and try to keep it nice and rhythmic. Don't dip too low as you might overextend your knees. How are you feeling? Feeling good. Okay, we'll just stay with it and try to take it at your own pace. If you really need a break, then take one. Beautiful job. You worked really hard on those weight loss exercises. You should be proud of yourself. And now let's go side on. Okay, now lean backwards with your left leg bent and your right foot pointing upward for a hamstring stretch. With your foot pointed upwards, it should feel comfortable and natural for your hamstring to stretch in this position. I want you to feel the stretch, but I definitely don't want it to be hurting. This should feel good right now. Perfect, just like that. Don't stop, I know what you're thinking. You're dying, it hurts, wah, wah, wah. You want to be skinny or not? You're like, I'm dying! My leg! Nice stretch. Come on. Really in. Why are you So doing? from here, lean backwards with your right leg bent and your left foot pointing upward for another hamstring stretch. It's important to stretch both legs equally, just as you should exercise on both sides. Keep it rolling. Stay on it. Try to keep your extended leg as straight as you can. Don't! Quit on me, you know why? Because quitting on me is quitting on yourself, and that's not what The Biggest Loser is all about. Try to keep your extended leg as straight as you can. Okay, now this stretch is in two parts. First of all, you're gonna step back on your left and lean forward into a runner stretch lunge, making sure that your back foot is flat to feel a nice stretch across your left calf. Pointing the toes toward the outside, pressing your heels down. Those arms ready to drop off yet? Perfect. And now step back with your right leg, leaning forward to gently stretch out that calf. So 
impressed. Excellent. Okay, back to the front, you guys, facing me. Sideways stretch. Feet shoulder width apart, raise both arms above your head and lean over to the left. You should feel a nice stretch in your obliques. Gently move into the stretch, don't bounce. Try not to move forwards or backwards. Imagine you are between two panes of glass. Keep it rolling. Good. Now, sideways stretch on the other side. Both arms over your head, now lean over to the right. How's it going? We can break for water if you want to take a moment to recharge. I want you to take one arm, reach it across your body, thumb is pointed up, and then just pull that arm towards you as you drop your shoulder down. That shoulder drops down away from your ears. Beautiful job. Perfect form. Great job. Switch to the other side. Let's go to the other side. Cross that one arm over. You're doing beautiful. Nice job. They make it easy. Let's get those triceps stretched. Elbows pointed straight up to the ceiling. Great job. Perfect form. You're going to do the exact same thing to the other side. Take that arm over your head. Good rhythm. I want you to try to take that arm all the way over your head and try to pat yourself on the back if you can. How are you feeling? Excellent. That's all I'm asking for. Good form and timing. Keep it up. Good job with the full body exercises. You really nailed them. You scored really well for the weight loss exercises in that routine. I'm sure you'll see the benefit in the weigh-in.